today we're going to be looking at how to plant out carrots. And we're going to start with the cosmic purple carrots that we uh, all got in the Baker Creek seed giveaway. Now here's a tip for planting carrots. Regardless of the type you are doing, I have here some coffee grounds. You can either dry out some spent coffee grounds or use fresh coffee grounds. One of the harder things with carrots is always the uh, spacing of the carrot. That's why you can actually buy carrot seed tape that already has the carrots well spaced out. They're just a small seed. Let's go ahead and pour some out into my hand. That's kind of you know hard to only release one at a time when you are just planting. So one thing you can do is pour them in here with some coffee grounds. Now, another tip, whether you're using this coffee ground method or not, is that radishes are a good plant to plant along with carrots. Because if you plant radishes, you can already know where the rows are because the radishes come up quicker than the carrots. The radishes are going to mature in about 30 days, whereas your carrots are going to take closer to 90 days. So you can go ahead and pull those radishes out and then have enough room remaining for the carrots to go through a full harvest. I have some white icicle radishes. This was just, I went and grabbed the first radishes I saw in my stack of seeds. These are not, these are not new radishes. They're several years old. Uh, I think they'll still work. So let's go ahead and pour those in too. All right, you see that I've got the radish seeds, radish seeds and carrot seeds in there. We're just gonna shake this all up. Getting the coffee grounds, the radish seeds, the carrot seeds, all well distributed. Use the airplane flying overhead. All right, now you look in here. Almost just looks like a thing of coffee grounds, but the seeds are distributed therein. So now we just pour them out into your hand. You want your rows to go roughly um, three inches apart. That's a little bit more than three inches, but it worked fine. Now the uh, coffee is going to help prevent pests, and it's also going to break down and help to fertilize the carrots as they're growing. Now I will not guarantee that this method will prevent any need to ultimately thin. You still have to look at how close your carrots ultimately end up, but uh, this should help with the process. Regardless of your growing method, carrots really like to be moist when they're germinating. So I have here just a simple sprayer. I just moisten those down. The coffee grounds should help to retain some of that moisture. Just give it a good soaking. Yes, some of the seeds might get displaced from the way I'm doing this, but it shouldn't be too bad. Just get a nice one. Let that soak down for a second. Honestly, when 
matter how you're growing your carrots, watering twice a day isn't a bad thing when you're waiting for germination. And there's that nice coffee smell when you do it with coffee grounds. So, there's the carrots planted out from the sea giveaway.